A soak pit is a type of effluent disposal system used to treat and dispose of the effluent coming out of a pretreatment system, safely to the ground. It is a type of soil absorption system, a smaller version of leach fields, and is suitable for treating and disposing of small effluent discharges wherever a wastewater treatment unit or system does not exist. A soak pit, also called a leach pit or seepage pit, is a covered porous walled chamber that allows effluent water to slowly soak through different filter layers and reach the ground. A soak pit chamber receives the effluent coming out from a primary treatment plant like a septic tank, aerobic treatment system, etc. Hence, it partially treats a pre-settled effluent. A soak pit consists of different layers of filters made of soil, gravel, or other mediums enclosed within a small chamber. The wastewater, gray water and black water, after their pretreatment, slowly percolates through this chamber. During the movement, the organic matter is digested by the microorganisms and the remaining water reaches the bottom and gets absorbed within the soil. The term leaching area refers to the portion of land or soil surface where effluent, liquid waste or wastewater, is distributed or discharged for the purpose of natural filtration, treatment, and absorption. The primary function of a leaching area is to allow the effluent to percolate or seep into the soil gradually, where it undergoes treatment through physical, chemical, and biological processes. These processes help remove impurities, pathogens, and pollutants from the effluent before it reaches groundwater or the environment. The two major types of soak pits are hollow soak pits and filled soak pits. A hollow soak pit is essentially a pit dug into the ground without any internal filling material, such as gravel or stones. It is typically a large, empty cavity in the ground. When wastewater from sources like septic tanks or gray water systems is directed into a hollow soak pit, it percolates directly into the surrounding soil. The soil's natural filtration properties help to treat the wastewater by removing impurities and pathogens as it moves through the soil layers. The primary treatment mechanism in a hollow soak pit is biological filtration. A filled soak pit, also known as a leach field or absorption trench, includes layers of filling materials such as gravel, stones, or coarse sand within the excavation. Wastewater flows into the filled soak pit where it encounters the filling material. The filling material provides additional surface area for the wastewater to interact with and facilitates better distribution of the effluent. As the wastewater moves through the layers of filling material, it is treated through physical and biological processes. The gravel or stones act as a filter and provide space for beneficial microorganisms to break down organic matter. Treated effluent then percolates into the surrounding soil. Let's discuss the suitability of soak pit construction. Soak pits are suitable where the effluent discharge from the pretreatment is not too high. This can save clogging and related hygiene issues. Soak pits must be constructed in areas with high saturation capacity and permeability. In general, they are most suitable for sandy soils with good absorption properties. It does not work for clay soils, hard-packed, or rocky soils. It is preferred in locations where the water table is low. Advantages of Soak Pits Soak pits are a means of cost-effective wastewater disposal. It has simple design suitable for various locations. It is an effective treatment through natural processes. It has reduced environmental impact, protecting groundwater. It is space efficient for densely populated areas. Soak pits have low energy consumption and is versatile in handling different wastewater types. If you are planning to install a soak pit, keep in mind the following considerations. The size of the soak pit can become complex sizing on soil and wastewater factors. It will regular maintenance to prevent clogging. Soak pit is not a complete solution for all contaminants or pathogens. For high concentration wastewater, higher treatment options must be opted. It is unsuitable for sites with high groundwater table level or impermeable soils. 
Improper design can cause environmental risks. Soak pit design must be compliant with local regulations. Possible odor issues if not well designed or maintained. We hope this video was informative and helpful. For more videos on construction and environment engineering, subscribe to our channel, Civil Engineering Fanatics. You can also visit our blog pradyogi.com to read more related articles.